Legion of Hazrael here, all like always, and Voltron, season three. I didn't know it was coming out this soon. I, lo I remember I was like, I wanted something space-based, but not something too, you know, I've seen all the Star Wars stuff, like crazy, all the cartoons, Netflix, you know, has the Clone Wars animated series, real fun to watch. Rebels, I thought was supposed to have a fourth season, but it kind of doesn't. Uh, so I'm like, I want something space-based, something awesome, something maybe animated would be kind of nice. You know what, let's watch, you know, Voltron season two again. Because, you know, who wants to watch the season one? Uh, I kind of want to, but... Uh, and then I was like, I wonder when the season three is coming out. And I remember like, I looked this up a while ago, and I'm like, oh, it's coming out in a while. And all of a sudden, I looked it up again, and it's coming out pretty goddamn soon. Uh, this is the season three Ultron trailer, and I'm actually pretty stoked. I'm a big fan of... <clears throat> uh, I watched the original Voltron when I was a lot younger, and even when I was that young, it was pretty hard to watch because it was the animation was pretty dated. But I still liked it, and I'm actually season two left me with a huge cliffhanger. Like, oh, I want to watch season three like now because I want to know what's going to happen because we never got this awesome stuff when we were watching these old animes on TV. They always kind of gave you the fun episodes, and then some of them were canceled. Look at Thundercats. The remake of Thundercats was supposed to be 52 episodes. It was 26, and that really sucks because it ended off on a huge story arc that was going to, you know, give us a whole season. So with these animes being remakes, Netflix, why don't you pick up Thundercats, man, please, and, and, and continue that remake. Uh, we would love to see that storyline continue. Um, me speaking on behalf of all of us older nerds and whatnot. But let's just get into Voltron now. The, one, the, the remake of the anime from ever ago that is actually being put out. Let's go. My what? father Dream built works. our empire on the bones of his enemies. Oh yeah, the sun. The universe can no longer doubt our strength, while those who continue to stand against us will be crushed. Is it Voltor? It may be difficult for us all to accept, but it is time to think about finding a new pilot. Shiro was the Black Lion, and until we find him, there is no Voltron. And where is your precious protector now? Gone. We've been set up! Everyone, watch your back! Okay. No Black Lion, no Voltron. Remain calm and get ready. We need to get out of here. We've been led into a trap. The tables have turned. He's flipped the script. The hunters have become the hunted. The only way we're getting out of here is if we work together. We have to believe in ourselves. This is our I'm team. looking forward to this. Who's with me? Yeah! yeah! Lotor is always one step ahead of us. We can't fight this guy alone. Keith, what should we do? We need an actual plan! You wish to challenge me? There's too many for the four of us! Fire! Now! No! Two days! Two fuckers! No Two! Lion, no Voltron. Uh, click me, I'm good. Oh god, dude, I'm looking. I'm looking. I can't wait. It's two fucking days, man. Two days. Two days. Um. This, honestly, I don't know what it is about this season. First of all, really quick, why does the red line always look so beat up? Look at him right there. Look at like, all the edges. I don't know if you can see it. I don't. Yeah. Look at all the edges. You can see those little white lines. He's always like beat up and torn. Like see the little see like his. Uh, you can't see my mouse. Like right there, the little. Oh oh, what am I doing? What am I, what's my finger doing? There we go. Uh, the little circle right there, and then to the to the right of the circle, it's just it's just scratch damage. Is this like Gundam Wing? It's like battle damage Gundam Wing. Is that what we're watching right now? Uh, this honestly does have a Gundam Double Zero feel to it. Um, it very much uh, the leader's gone or something. The world's against us. We're gonna lose. It very much has a, a Gundam Double Zero feel to it. I think to me, where just everything is not in your favor, and somehow they have to persevere. Uh, I, I'm I'm actually pretty damn stoked. I'm I'm really hyped, really excited that the season three is finally coming out. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but wasn't Voltor the son? Wasn't he like a big disappointment in the original Voltron? Like wasn't he like somebody that can never get the job done? 
I thought that's what it was. I don't remember. I don't know, but in this, I, I just, oh man, I wish this had like a world, an expansive shit. I could honestly, I could see Voltron being a, being a movie, like a Guardians of the Galaxy type. Not so campy with like all the, I just spit right out of my mouth, right out of my monitor. Uh, not so campy, but uh, yeah, I could definitely see this being like, if the lions weren't so colorful, like how the new Power Rangers were colorful, um, something maybe darker, um, something different. Like the like the ship wasn't like this big huge castles. Maybe a smaller type ship that was like a warship. The the like like Double Zero. If anybody's ever seen Gundam Double Zero, or you don't know, Google it and look at the carrier. It was a very small ship with four external holders for the Gundams and then there was a you know then you when you were in one of them there was a you know a door that led into this the main ship but the thing spun and everything and I thought if you if you took a similar approach to having more of a warship with that was a little smaller princess and everybody wasn't so proper uh you could definitely make an awesome movie out of this but it'd be really cool if this was a full-fledged like animated 50 episodes all release and it had just a huge expansive world with all these different alien races and adventures and not so, uh, not so, you know, like Disney XD, I guess I should say, even though it's DreamWorks, um, not so Nickelodeon feel, something a little darker. Uh, that would be really cool. And for any, and for anybody that needs that, doesn't have that, check out, uh, Guardians uh, of the Galaxy, the animated series, I believe is what it's called. Yeah. That gives you kind of there's like three seasons of that, so you can watch that. But uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm I'm looking forward to it. I would love to see a huge expansive world in Voltron. Um, honestly, the world is is just as fun. Uh, and you could I, I I know this might be kind of dumb, but you could kind of lose the lions, and I still be kind of happy with the show. I think I think I'd be all right with it. Yeah. But with that, I'm gonna get out of here. So thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Like the video, like the content. You can always like, subscribe, and share. Remember, it's complete up to you. I do appreciate it though. It does help me out. Uh, in some way or another. If you want to leave a comment on this video and this channel in general, or let's reverse that. If you want to leave a comment on this channel on this sp video specifically, uh, I'd love to see all the comments down below. Once again, my name is Azrael, and I'll see you on whatever video I'm doing next. Later, guys.